Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his monthly bill? It's over 9,000! What, 9,000? There's no way that can be right! Hello, and welcome to James the Lesser Express Line, where we get you in and out as fast as possible with the video that broke DSP. This is fantastic. Let's watch it together. And here's another one. This guy makes fun of me. Let's give Miss it to Cruz. He makes fun of me for my review of Cup Noodles. If you're not aware, when I was playing Final Fantasy 15 many years ago, so this was like six, seven years ago when it first came out, it was a new release, they had Cup Noodles in the game, okay, as a product placement advertisement. Yes, so they did. So I decided and you that found I was going to fuck actually it up. do a Cup Noodles DSP Tries It, back when I used to do DSP Tries It, which was like a, a taste you test ate show. noodles with a spoon. I said, let's do a head-to-head -head taste test between the shrimp and I think the other one, was it chicken? I can't remember what the two flavors were. So I did it, and basically, it was entertaining because, you know, it wasn't, it's not a high-level show. It's not professional. So I had a spoon that I was trying to eat the noodles with because I felt I wanted to scoop the broth and taste the broth with the spoon. But I also No, you said in the video, guys, it's a soup. You eat soup with a spoon. Why isn't this working? Because you're a fucking moron. Also, I think I didn't grab a fork to, to actually, like, fork the noodles with. So their biggest criticism I got during it was that, basically, I, w I kept using a spoon to try to eat noodles, and the noodles would, like, slip out of the spoon or whatever. All right? But that was it. Like, so, it, uh, somehow it became legendary. Everyone making fun of me for e eating cup noodles or something. I'm like, okay. Eating cup noodles with a spoon after using your $500 Keurig machine to boil the water. This is boiling the water on top of the stove like a person. You did so many fucking things in this video, it's hard to remember it all. But the main points that I remember is, A, eating noodles with a spoon and then crying... Guys, and you don't stay on the spoon. What do I do? What do I do, guys? It won't stay on the spoon. It's a soup. You eat soup with a spoon. Fucking moron. And yes, made fun of you for using a fucking five hundred dollar cure egg machine to boil the water. This is boiling on top of the fucking stove like a little person does. Goddamn alien. Anyways, let's continue. I don't know what you're really making fun of me for. All right, but well, all right. Being let's an see. alien. With a brand new DSL tries it. <laughs> okay. Now, uh, for those of you that don't know, DSL tries it is a series where I basically eat things and put adverts on the videos so I get paid for eating, basically. <laughs> Excuse me. Anyway, uh -huh. so, uh, what you can expect from this sort of video is uh, shaky uh, camera work, and uh -huh. my hand will feature heavily because I point at things on screen because, well, my viewers are quite stupid and they don't know <laughs> what I'm talking So if I say I'm trying this and I don't point at it, they won't know. He's having a problem with me pointing at things in a video. He thinks that's bad. Let's make it bigger. I pointed at something in a video. Would you prefer to just stare at the, the noodles on the counter? Nothing? Yes, because your hand is so much more entertaining. What, the hand thing actually originated with, with release day unboxing, if you're not aware. Because during release day unboxing, I used to unbox a game, and I would open up with my hands and show you all the things inside of it. So I kind of got used to pointing and doing mannerisms with my hands during videos. And sometimes this would carry over to DSP Tries It with food. Late, what ended up happening was eventually I turned the camera on me and it would be me eating the food rather than me doing stuff and with my hands in the so food. And it was so much worse. But in this case, this was a rare case where I kept the camera on the food because you, how am I going to aim a camera at me trying to eat these noodles? I wanted to show me making the noodles and everything, you know, adding the water and showing what it actually looked like inside the cup. So it was more of the first person perspective rather than the third person, which I did in some of the other videos. But this guy actually has a problem with me pointing at things in a video. That's his criticism. And Shaky Cam, well, yeah, because I'm using my hand to film. I did have it on a tripod filming me for the third person segments, okay? And you know what he keeps going with his nose? That's because I have post nasal drip. And when I eat my post nasal I recently found out my mom has post nasal drip. I never knew. You know why? Because every time I ever hung out with her or talked to her on the phone, I never heard. <laughs> Amazing. She's apparently had it for decades. And I never knew. For decades. Because not once did I hear make any fucking god awful noises like he does. Anyways, let's continue. Nasal drip tends to kick in. For some reason, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like humidity or heat or cold. But when I start to eat, my post nasal drip kicks in. Let me. T <clears throat> He's in quite a bit on stream. His DSP tries it, his feasting with the king, his summer digital party, or digital summer party DSP, whatever. He's in a lot on stream. And yet he doesn't immediately start snorting up a storm. Hmm. 
tell you guys something, all right? And I'm not trying to get sympathy or whatever. It's not nice. If I, every time I eat a meal, I've got snot dripping down the back of my throat. So I can't fully enjoy meals like other people do because every single time I try to eat, I have to deal with that. And I have to be clearing my throat and blowing my nose. When's the last time you blew your nose on stream while eating? Here's the hint. He hasn't. This is all such bullshit. Half the time when my wife makes dinner, I have to have tissues at the table. So when I'm eating, I can blow my nose to taste the food. Okay? But people think it's funny. Oh, that's funny. No, it's a medical condition. It's not funny. It's something I've had to deal with my whole life. It's, it's not hilarious. Funny to make fun of someone for having a medical condition. It's something yes, that's been prevalent is. in my videos for 15 years because I've always had it. I don't know why people think it's funny to make fun of someone for having a medical problem, right? It is when the person snores directly into the microphone all the time. But let's see. During the courting interview, no snorting. During the bankruptcy call, not a single snort during the entire bankruptcy call. Huh. Almost as if he can control it. Almost as if when he's not trying to annoy his audience, like say a bankruptcy lawyer or a bankruptcy judge, he's able to not snort directly into the microphone. Imagine that. If this guy had, I don't know, a, a chronic cough because he had a problem with his lungs or a problem with his throat, would I make fun of him for chronically coughing? It's this thing I- If he chronically coughed directly into the microphone without muting it or at least turning his head away, that's the thing. DSP will literally lean into the microphone, snort, and then lean away. Oh no, my allergy is acting up, but I'm coughing a bit. A, take some better drill before I start a stream. Then B, instead of leaning into the microphone to cough, I lean away from it. I turn my head. Maybe I try to mute. So forth. I can't solve. I've been to doctors for it. There's no solution for it. It just happens. I've had it my whole life. It's hereditary. My dad has it too. Oh, make fun of me because I have to do this in my video so that I don't have snot pouring down everywhere in my, my respiratory system. Oh, you're really funny. You know, good Very on you that you don't have medical problems for people to make fun of. But make fun of me because, again, I'm a YouTuber As who makes should. videos that are popular. I make money and a living doing it. So make fun of my medical shortcomings because I'm the target. But God forbid the camera ever turned towards you because I'd probably find way more funny to make fun of on you than you ever did with me. I like the blue hair guy that got you banned from Twitch for a bit. But, you know, that's the difference between them and me. Anyway, let's continue. This guy's hilarious so far. So I can't point at things. That's not allowed. And God forbid I have a medical problem. Okay, let's continue. What other ingenious things he'll come up with to criticize me with? So for those of you watching, I'm trying this. Pot noodle. Yes, pot noodle. I'm not even kidding. I'm trying pot noodle. Um, and because it worked out so well last time, uh, I've, on my other DSL tries it, where I tried microchips and I had to learn to use a microwave, which was a real piece of shit, by the way. And um, <laughs> uh, I basically, I had to stream shit. <clears throat> okay, I'm just going to fast forward because so far nothing's happened. I actually want to see when he starts making this. How he does it and how he makes fun of it. And you skipping okay, over Okay, here we it. go. This is what I want to see when he actually gets to it. This you doing skipped in over there, it. Someone at the factory has dropped some sort of sachet in here. I could easily sue because I could have easily have eaten this and choked to death. So, not a good start. What? Now, as we look in, we see kind of a powdery substance. What is this? I mean, look. That does not look appetizing. Now, in Final Fantasy, you have to uh, pay a thousand gil for this, which I'm going to assume is about 10 million dollars okay so basically <laughs> swear, anyone having fun yet anyone laughing yes do i do this in my dsp tries do i shove my fingers into the raw food that's not cooked what, what, what is he doing you literally touch the toilet multiple times while making your bacon egg sandwich thing you touch the toilet multiple times without ever washing your hands you would literally touch the toilet to pour grease down the toilet and then not wash your hands you drop something on the floor and then you picked it up and you still ate it shut the fuck up annex are saying that this is worth 10 million dollars um um ar, 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 ar. yes yeah, uh, yeah, uh, uh, 10 million dollars of powder did he just say art 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 what does he think he's popeye he thinks i sound like popeye he's making fun of your act 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 jackass get over it It's not fucking cocaine, okay? So, anyway, I digress. <laughs> Excuse me. So, now we have to pour the boiling water into uh, into this. I'm laughing now because what you can tell, all he did is he tried to take my mannerisms and shove them in to act like it's funny. Just because you're impersonating someone's speech or mannerisms doesn't mean it's funny. Yes, it does. There's, he hasn't done a single thing insightful or funny yet. Okay. It doesn't have to be insightful. It just has to be funny, which it is. Um... 
Uh, so it, it needs to be pulled up to the, uh, the fill level. <laughs> yes, the fill level. I'm not even kidding. It says the fill level. Yes. Um, so let's uh, <coughs> excuse me. Let's do that now. So yes, happen to pour. I mean, the, the the noodle doesn't explain. It doesn't explain where the fill level is. I'm guessing it's that line there that says fill, but you know, it doesn't doesn't actually explain. So he's he's just repeating things that I say. It doesn't have any sense to it. Like if I said, oh, it doesn't actually explain, it because I'm doing something where something's not explained. Shut the fuck up. He literally just said, it is explained. There's a line on it that says fill level. But they don't explain what the fill level is. But it did. It's on the cup. So taking something I said as a mannerism and interjecting it into this is not funny. It just makes you stupid. Yes, it All is. you're it's doing very is funny. what I've said out of context from what I would actually say. Out of context, guys. I don't think this guy actually understands the concept of parody. I don't think he understands it at all. all you're yes, he does. He's funnier than you are. Get over it. ...is repeating a saying that I say. That's not parody. Okay. So, as we can see now, uh, the, the hot water's in, and it's become less of a powder, okay? So, we're, uh, as you can see, that does not look appetizing. Basically, this is just like, a, a, I guess, student food for those idiots that instead of getting a full-time adult job and full-time adult house, they actually think that education is key. Well, you're a fucking idiot, because look what you're eating. Well, I'm getting paid thousands of dollars from Patreons and eating lobster and steak. Go. Do you see? I mean, do you see where it all stirs from? I mean, he just revealed it right there. Absolutely. He absolutely is saying, oh, you see, Phil's rich because he has all this money because he makes YouTube videos and he doesn't deserve it. He's an asshole. So that is it, it, one. There you go. This is incredibly similar. But this is just this running pattern that I see. You made so much money. You've literally made roughly from what we can figure out from tips, Patreon, whatever, roughly two million dollars. Across, let's say, 16, 17 years, between YouTube, Patreon, Blip, Twitch, uh, his job at the helicopter company, whatever. In 16 years, he's made roughly two million dollars. He finally does own his car. He paid his car off in July. Congratulations. Took you six years to pay off that car when you should have been able to just show up with cash and gone, boom, send me that car, goodbye. But you never own the Connecticut condo. You don't own the Washington condo. So literally the only thing that is in your name that doesn't belong to anyone else is your car. Congratulations. Two million dollars, well spent. Seen over the years, the people who dislike me the most are the people who secretly are the most jealous. It's true. This guy's insanely jealous that I'm able Yes, to he's insanely jealous that you have to hide in your house all day, every day, ordering DoorDash. Because if you ever left the house, you might run into evil AJ. Or Tevin. Or heaven forbid. One of your actual fans. Because holy shit, that'd be the worst. Can you imagine running into Derek in real life? Ugh, no, thank you. I'd rather not to make YouTube videos and make a living doing it. So he makes a video like this trying to make fun of me. He makes fun of my medical condition. He makes fun of my mannerisms of what I say. He hasn't done a single thing funny yet. All he's doing is yes, ad, he ad verbatim repeating things that I do. Very funny. Without context, you see? Where's but, the context, again, guys? This is a thing that people do, and they say, oh, you see, this is funny. What is funny about this yet? I still have, if there was a- Because he's making fun of you. That's why you don't find it funny. If he was making fun of Wings or RTU or Boogie, or Keemstar, oh god, if he was making fun of Keemstar, you'd be laughing your ass off. Joke that razzed me or something, I'd be like, okay, there hasn't been a single joke that razzed me yet. And we've watched, this is the second video in a row of this style that hasn't had a valid thing to say yet. All right, let's continue. We'll watch a little more. Ready? Going on staycations. Okay, I digress. <clears throat> there you go. I digress, clearing my throat. So, that's the pot noodle there, by the way, for anyone that's uh, having trouble keeping track. Um, uh, oh god, people on the stream chat uh, are saying that um, I don't stream DSP tries it. You have done reactions to your DSP tries it before. Shut the fuck up. What are you talking about? I don't stream DSP tries it. So why would you say there's a stream chat? You. <laughs> you could. What the hell? This is a very lazy way for me to make money. I'm basically just filming myself eating noodles. Well, do you know what? I'm gonna block you. I'm, I'm, I'm some fucking idiots in the stream Again. chat. Again. So he's jealous that I made money doing a taste testing series. By the way, I was not the only person to ever do a taste testing series. I'm certainly not the last. There's people now who their entire channel is taste testing, and they get millions of views and millions of dollars doing it. And they don't snort directly into the microphone. They don't touch the toilet multiple times and then not wash their hands. 
They don't eat fucking noodles with a spoon. Jackass. What is the criticism here? This is unbelievable. This is very difficult. There's boiling water involved, which I could easily scold myself, by the way. And uh, I'm taking a huge risk here. Right, so. Uh, uh, okay, so, it's, uh, so we, we take a look now. Uh, oh my god. Look at the. <laughs> look at this. Ar, 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 ar. Look. Here again, there's the Popeye laugh, because I laugh like Popeye, apparently. Okay. Ack, look at ack, this. Ack. Yes. The noodles, they look like, um, they look like little dicks. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> they, they look like little dicks. Like, yes, yes. Here's, here's, um, a, a giant jar of, uh, of a pot dicks. Yes. Dude, this is so cringeworthy. I can feel it in my soul. Ladies and gentlemen, I made DSP Tries It for about 10 years. It started back when I was vlogging, and I retired it like maybe five years ago or so, okay? Officially. I, do, I bring it back every once in a while. Can you tell me once ever in the history of DSP Tries It that I said that the food that I was about to eat looked like a bunch of dicks? You probably have. If not on camera, in person. You've literally said before, like, oh, this looks like diarrhea. Oh, this looks like shit. Oh. I just let's watch a different video to cleanse our palate from this junk shall we okay oh he is so hurt by this he is so hurt by that he was not having a good time as he ends at uh-oh only 53 dollars guys he only made 53 dollars on the stream in tips guys How's he supposed to afford a WWE Champions if you only give him $53,000 in tips? Hmm. That time will let you guys go. Thank you for watching. As always, like, subscribe, comment down below, and have one hell of a day.